Hi guys, Oliver Eaton here and welcome to Premier League Predictions here on Oliver Eaton on YouTube. It is week 34 and this week we have 11 games to predict. All those are on screen now, we will be predicting those through the video. But as always, we're going to start with your viewers' predictions. Uh, and here we go, and I'm quite proud actually, uh, between the three of them. Uh, two got the Wolves Man U game ban on, that was Admit Shah and Dan Bundy. Uh, Cisco Power going the wrong way there. Uh, please keep all your predictions coming in, we will be focusing on them even more next series. Uh, next season so we look forward to that here's my predictions I got 1610 which is probably one of our personal records actually uh, that consisted of all those scores there no big fat zeros as well which is pretty pleasing and that means in the Eton League 3 we are currently now up to 5th as Ivan Madras stays inactive we're bottom of all the active people but let's just turn a blind eye to it and without further ado, let's get to this week's Premier League predictions, starting with Leicester Newcastle. And our predictions for this was a 2 0 win to Leicester. Leicester picked up a 4 1 win at a struggling Huddersfield, and now against Newcastle, who are trying to climb the table themselves. I've gone for a 2 0 to the home team, though, here. I think Brendan. Rogers has stabilised the ship now there at King Power. I think they'll get the win. Tottenham, Huddersfield, 3-0 to Tottenham. Um, Huddersfield, we're dead and buried. Uh, and The team's falling apart a wee bit now. And Tottenham, they've got good momentum. They've just picked up a brilliant win in the Champions League. And they'll get a good 3-0 win here at their stadium. Brighton, Bournemouth, 2-1 to the away team here. Oh, I've gone for a Bournemouth win. Uh, I keep putting Bournemouth to win uh, and then never do. But... You know, they have the talent there, and Brighton are struggling this season. They could uh, they could be competitive here at their ground, but they will be struggling if they lose this. Burnley, Cardiff, 2-1 to the home team. Finally, the second time of the season I've predicted Burnley to win. It's been that much, but I think Burnley a lot stronger now. Uh, they seem to have turned the corner since January, but I think Cardiff they could be thrown into the deep end here in the relegation fight. Fulham, 2 Nil loss to Everton. Everton, another team who I haven't been predicting much to win, but they have been winning. Uh, so I predicted them to win this game. The Fulham down and out now, and they wanted to really damage limitation to their score, but 2 0. Southampton, Wolves, 2 1. Wolves got defeated, the threw away 2 0 lead at Wembley. Uh, they're going Southampton, they're relegation bound as well at the moment, um, fighting in that bottom six, but I think. They'll lose this game, they'll be competitive though, but Wolves will just have the upper hand. Manchester United versus West Ham. I've gone for a 3-1 home win. We don't know how the Champions League have gone yet, that'll be tonight, but 3-1. I think it's a fair score considering both teams' sides. West Ham, they have some key players who could try and be threatening, but I've gone for a loss there. This is a shocker score, but I just feel that Palace could do this. Man City just been defeated by Tottenham. I think they'll be focusing on that second leg more. I think Crystal Palace could win them here. Roy seems to be uh, quite tactical in these type of games, and I think 2 1 could be the score there. Liverpool versus Chelsea, a potential banana skin uh, game for Liverpool in their title race, but I've gone for a 2 1 home win. Of course, it's 1 1 in the reverse fixture. Uh, Chelsea, this is their big opportunity to try and battle for the top four as well. Watford, Arsenal, I've gone for a 1 1. Arsenal failing to keep clean sheet at home still. And I think they'll fail again. Watford uh, got through to the FA Cup final. They'll have that momentum behind them. And I think they'll get a good result here with that 1-1 one, one draw. And last but not least, on the Tuesday night, Brighton, Cardiff. I've gone for a 2-2 in this relegation six-pointer match. Uh, it'll be very close. Brighton, I would think, are more favourites to get a result from this than Cardiff, though. 2-2, two -two, though. And there we go, those are my predictions. Thank you for watching. If indeed you still are, we'll join you next week. For more predictions, make sure you comment down below and I'll reflect on the next episode. But until then, bye bye.